Well, hello everyone. Good morning and welcome to Subsistence Land. Look at that. There, he's wandering. Oh, he went behind a tree or something. But I was just watching Mr. Uh, Mr. Charlie over there wandering around causing trouble. <laughs> Hopefully we're not going to see him today. Um, now, what is the plan for today? The plan for today, well, we don't have a lot of time. It is uh, morning and what we have to do is we have to do things like uh, check out to make sure Ah, that's all right. We'll have to live with it. Um, I do want to make a second uh, plant bed, by the way. Um, yeah, uh, basically, I'm going to need uh, to augment my food because of, oh, I don't know, something here. <laughs> oh, what level are you now? You're level eight. Ooh. Oh, nice. Okay, so let's top up water and food. Now, what is the plan? The plan is we are going to go uh, cougar hunting. We're going camping. It's a camping trip. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I'm going to be gone for a while, so there's a few things I want to do. One of them is uh, to try to make sure the power is as high as possible. Now, the nice thing is, in the last update, um, these guys will turn off automatically when this reaches peak power. So, I don't know if that's enough fuel to get there, but, yeah. Hey, what what is the, uh, right now, it's a .44 out. Oh, yeah, we're not running you right now. Okay. All right. That's cool. That's cool. We got ourselves another iron. Nice. Might as well keep that going. Why not? All right. But I don't want to run this for while I'm gone because, uh, yeah, power. Power is an issue. It looks like the weather is going to be kind of iffy. There's a bit of wind. Uh-oh. All right. So, all right, all right, right. Now, let's, uh, let's, yes, yes, food for the animals, food and water, food and water, food and water. Uh, let's grab you. Let's grab a couple of you. Oh, what the heck. And we'll also grab that. All right. We're just going to do some last minute stuff before we head out. So uh, let's see. A tomato. Oh, I should do water first. Eh, maybe that doesn't matter, actually. And there we go. All right. So they're fully. F now, I don't know how long they're going to be able to last with that without me being here. That's see, this is one of the reasons why I was a little concerned about having the animals is because. Um, yeah, I don't know what the. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Today's not great hunting weather. Oh, well. <laughs> I wonder if I should... Uh, I'm not sure whether I should put it off or not. It's probably not. We do have a, a location up there. Um, we have a little cabin. We have a, another wood stove. Oh, I need to eat, too. Uh, let's see. Let's grab you. And let's have you. And... Uh, and a tomato. And actually, I'm going to need one of those waters for myself. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah. Uh, going up on the mountain when it's raining, not a great idea. Oh, man, that sucks. Um, oh, I'm going to need shotgun shells. Yeah. Ugh. All right, let's do that. Let's make some shotgun shells. Oh, I can, I can make a shotgun shell. What am I short on? Gunpowder. Well, um, <laughs> no, I don't need fertilizer. Yeah, I'm not going to have enough. I don't have enough materials to make gunpowder even. Oh, boy. Yeah, this is, uh, we're not in really the best shape when it comes to uh, materials for uh, bullet making. Oh, that's not good. Well, I guess we'll just have to avoid using the shotgun. I guess. That's a probably, oh, you know, I've got way too much uh, SVT ammo on me. Hang on a minute. Let's, um... Yeah, let's have 18. I'll tell you what, that's probably the best bet. We'll have 18 of you. Uh, we could have more. Oh, right, that's where all my gunpowder went. Yeah, but that's that's the uh, the the, char the charge. I don't want to lose that. So, hmm. Ah, let's do it. Why not? Okay. So, what have I got on me? I'm going to take, uh, let's see, I've got five and five for bandages and stuff. Uh, I don't have... I should take, I should make a splint. What is this? I never use the darn things, but... Oh, it's a, it's a stick. Okay. All right. Let's do that. Let's make a stick. All right. And then once we do that, we can make ourselves a nice splint. There we go. And then we'll put that in here just so we have it backed up. And then maybe actually what we should do is replace that bandage. One, two, three, four, five, six. With a few bandages. There we go. Perfect. 
All right, do I want to get into this? This is the question. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, we've got 26 of you. We've got 10 of you. I'm going to take... Um, ah, I'm going to take the... the uh, protein bars up to the to the to the camp just just so that they're there uh or at least a part a part of them maybe yeah all right well um the only other thing i should probably think about is water so i'm going to grab a couple of canteens of water and now how's my arrow supply it's terrible so we're going to grab some arrows which we don't have did i put them upstairs have i been using that many arrows <gasps> Oh, wow. That's amazing, isn't it? Uh, is it? Is it just me? I'm not seeing them. Oh, okay. That's cool. We'll sort that out. That's, uh, now this will make 20 sticks. And then uh, I think I only need 10 f feathers. Is that right? And then I need t uh, 20 nails. There we go. And then we're going to find out in a second if that's enough to make uh, enough to make uh, all the arrows. I, I just want to have the arrows because <laughs> just for whatever reason. Um, now, what we could also do is take a couple of tomatoes just for for uh, extra food. And uh, pro so we got protein bars. We've got vegetables. We've got water. And then we can let's see if we can if that'll my formula was right. I think should make. There you go. That's perfect. All right. Okay, so the primary weapon I'm going to use against the uh, the cougars is the SVT. I'll tell you what, 18. Let's make that an even 20. Then that's basically uh, four reloads, right? And I think we're good. Now, is anybody coming? Hey, guys. Oh, a level nine chicken. Oh, wow. Oh, there's a crate out there. All right, so how's your food? 10% already. Oh, wow. Um, oh, man. I tell ya. They, these guys go... Oh, I didn't want to use a tomato. Oh, well, that's fine. <laughs> uh, it's always like this when you're trying to go out for a trip and stuff. Oh, but I... Oh, man, I'm, I'm a little concerned about the water. Not the water, the, uh, the weather. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to bring two. There we go. All right, good enough. Now, I'm, I'm basically, we are going to go after the cougar, but we're not going to do a full... Uh, the trip, we're basically going to just overnight, but we're going to have to come back relatively early because uh, I, I am worried about, uh, about my little uh, furry friends and my feathered friend there, so... Oh, boy. All right. Oh, thought that fiber was a hunter. <laughs> that would have been awesome. N well, not really, but yeah. <laughs> All right, so we're going to head up uh, this route. Ooh. Got bears, got wolves, nothing. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh man, this is terrible weather for this. All right, we're not. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I hear you, wolf. I hear you. Oh. Oh. I don't. I think they spotted me. All right, let's just keep moving. Do 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 do. Oh man, this is terrible. Oh, sorry, I'm not. I'm not paying attention. Keep going. Keep going, though. All right. But yeah, we need the sinews, so there's nothing else for it. We gotta. We gotta get this done. Okay. So the. I'm gonna take this route this time. Now there was some discussion in the uh, the comments about. Um, oh, hello, bear. Oh, hello. Oh, oh, this is. All right, we're probably going to piss the bear off, but I've also got hunters to worry about to my left there. Is that bear behind me? Hurry, hurry! 
Okay, move, move. <laughs> right, so where was I? Yes, we were discussing the uh, alternative path. So the alternative path is to go down the other side of the lake and cut over. Okay. All right, all right. This is not the right place to dawdle. We're kind of close to one of the hunter bases. But basically, yeah, the other path is to uh, to go down the uh, the other side of the lake and then cut over and then straight up uh, where basically where the neck is and then take that because that's generally the route uh, to the to that cougar spawn, right? That's, you know, in the in the co-op game, that's how we get there. So that would have been another way to get up to that position. But uh, this is the other way. Now, fortunately, uh, yeah, I got one biofuel on me. All right, so that's good. Um, the reason why that's good is because I think I forgot to bring fire starter. <laughs> yeah, and uh, at least with the uh, wood, I can make fire starter. At least I think I can. Uh, no, um, biofuel. I need biofuel, uh, a stick or two, and some fiber. And I think what I've picked up six fiber, so that's more than enough. If uh, we, if the, there's no, I might have left some matches. It's hard to say. All right, let's keep going. Oh man, this weather is terrible. Yeah, this. I don't know if this is a mistake or not, but <laughs> well, there's only one way to find out. <laughs> My stamina's holding up. Now, here's the problem with uh, this cold weather. I'm going to go up. I know that's probably a mistake because it's colder even. But I do want the visibility. Oh, there's my uh, hunting platform. Excellent. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, nice. So the hunting platform is shelter. Uh, oh, it's got... We, we can harvest some wood and get the fire going. Now, let's see. Let's take a look at the situation. We are out of fuel. Now, did I? What did I bring? I've got a fuel. Oh, I brought water. That's right. And then, is there any? And I also brought nice. So I was actually kind of thinking almost. And there's also ash, which is awesome. I kind of like the fact that. Hey, rabbit, how you doing? Uh, I kind of like that. That it, it gets quiet when you come inside this thing. Uh, I also left the hammer and some building supplies, so that's kind of cool. Uh, here's some tomatoes. I'm going to basically just put these in there for now. And then I'm going to keep these on me because they're they're good for emergency food. Um, I'm kind of... Here, what we're going to do is we're just going to put uh, this stuff along here. Because we might... We'll have to decide what to take back with us. Uh, definitely need to take the ash. Definitely need to take the casings and the gunpowder. Uh, you can go in there and then the berries. I'll keep the berries on me in the water. And uh, then what we could do is let's uh, let's top up our uh, our food just in case. All right. Now, what were we here for? We were here for uh, uh, cougars. And yeah, so now we got to find one in the rain. <laughs> Oh, this is... <laughs> hey there, rabbit. Hey, rabbit. Rabbit. Hey. Do you see any cougars? Oh, okay. He's not a, he's not a rabbit of many words. Uh, he's a rabbit of action. Now, uh, the problem is that with all this rain, I can't hear. Specifically, I can't hear cougars. <gasps> nice. Good timing, Rain. Thank you very much. I do appreciate it. All right, let's see if we can f find the cougar. Oh, there's a crate up there. No, no, no. We're here for one reason. Now, the cougar's usually right over here. Hmm. I don't hear a cougar.
<laughs> Sorry, I have to be quiet because I gotta I gotta listen for the cougar. Okay, let's uh let's head down a little from the mountain a bit. Uh, actually, let's come around this way. I want to try to keep some high ground. There it is. Doot, doot, doot. <laughs> now it could catch up to me because these things are damned fast. <laughs> Hello, cougar. Now, I don't think he actually is still chasing me. If he still is, I'm, see, I'm not going to stop because if I did and he's still chasing me, I could get myself into some serious trouble. All right. Did I? Yeah, he's still down there somewhere. You better watch out, chicken. There's an angry cougar down there somewhere. Okay. Where is the cougar? Oh, there he is. I didn't get very far at all. All right, let's see if we can uh, put one more in you. There we go. Come on up. <laughs> yeah, we'll do a little reload. Oh, I think this time the cougar is actually interested. Oh, actually, no. I think we lost it. But we'll find out. There it is. Okay. Oops. Oh, that's so cool. Come on up, cougar. Actually. Whoop. <laughs> I actually jumped on <laughs> jumped on the cougar. <laughs> that's so awesome. <laughs> oh, that was not purposeful. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, nice. Five, five sinew. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, yeah. Now, how much time do we have? Yeah, so we don't have a lot of time. What I would like to do... Oh, I need to wash my hands. Now, I do have water for that, but I'm going to not waste it on washing my hands. I'm going to head down to the river here. I think what we're going to do... Um, we're not going to be too ambitious about the cougar hunt today. Uh, oh, there's a bear right there. Okay, let's come down here then. Uh, the, the cougar in this spawn is gone, and I could go and attempt to find the, the cougar over... Oh, great. Yeah, we knew that was going to happen. Hey, bear. Don't mind me. Oh, man. So they're now they're, they're, they're beating up my base. Oh, that was from that incident. See that, that right there? You see that um, pointy rock? There's like the two pointy rocks. Yeah, right on the other side of that is, uh, is another cougar spawn. But the problem is that I don't know if we can... Mm. Don't know if we can handle that in one day. Well, let's go take a look. Maybe we can. Uh, probably what I should have done is uh, dumped my materials, what I've got so far in, in the chest back there, so that uh, if we die... Hey, chicken. Uh, I've got food, right? Uh, you got a couple of steaks. Um, well, maybe we'll get a chicken. Well, if we find another cougar, that would be helpful too. I hear something. Ugh. Danger sounds. Did I see something right there? No, that's a tree. Those trees, I tell ya, sometimes they act like cougars. Um, anything down here? No. All right. Uh, let's take the high route. Uh, probably. Oh, I'm. A, I am really worried about time, though. See, the problem is without the uh, the cougar camp. Uh, the best that my little my uh, little camp po outpost there, the best way to to get a go after cougars is to essentially um, hit them from range. 
and I don't I don't know if uh, we're gonna have time because it, you have to you have to sort of do it slowly you pull, you hit them once yeah and I'm getting cold too that's a wolf I think yeah it's a wolf Oh, I'm running out of daylight. And it's going to get cold and I'm going to lose stamina. Yeah, there is a cougar spawn over here. I have, I always have trouble. This is the one, um, actually, I'll tell you, the first cougar that I ever ran into was over here was uh was basically see the that where those rocks are right there that's part of quote the new map so basically um the old map basic well there's been a few extensions on the map and at one point uh the the map ended right around here and that wasn't in the map and so then the map was extended to add those rocks and when that map extension was done i think the cougars were brought in before the map extension i'm not sure all right i'm not no this is uh we're running out of time. If I, I'm going to get myself into trouble here where I'm not going to be able to run. Uh, because, uh, because it's getting cold. It's already zero degrees. And uh, you don't rebuild stamina when you're cold. So, yeah, I could get myself into a situation where I end up getting killed. And I don't really want to do that. So probably uh, what we're going to end up doing is we're just, as I say, we're not going to get too aggressive with this particular... Uh, run uh, i'm going to go after the one cougar today and then essentially what i'm going to do is uh come when we come back in the morning uh and the next day uh we'll go after that cougar again and then we will head back to the base so that is the general plan in the meantime i think what we'll do is we'll just do maybe a bit of looting and and sort of looking around i don't get over here very often so it's kind of nice uh, we're going to avoid that bear. Yeah, and we're running it. Look at how quick. See how quickly the sun starts going down and it's getting dark? Oh, yeah. Now, what would be really nice, actually, is if that cougar respawned over here. But I I somehow doubt it. I just I doubt it. More. Nice. More ammo. Sweet. All right. But we'll take a look just in case. I don't hear him. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Oh, what is that? Is that a chicken? Oh, hey there, chicken. How you doing? <laughs> oh, yeah. There we go. Um, okay. Uh, anything down here? This is a really... Do oh, I don't have a lockpick. That's good, because if I found a lock crate right now, I'd be super sad. Uh, I think that's a crate right there, though. Okay. Now, the other thing about this little area down here is it is a real... Uh, could, wait, did I saw a crate. Yes, I did see a crate. Good. A real hotbed for uh, um, rogues. So they like to right in here and over the... Yeah, it's really bad. So, <laughs> yeah. It's one of the reasons why I was kind of avoiding that situation right... Uh, but see, that's what you can do is you can come up the lake and cross over and then right up here and then you're basically right at it. And I think what we'll do when we head back um, tomorrow uh, in the next episode, um, we'll basically take that route back. Uh, it's I think it's less risk as far as running into... Oh, hey there. Uh, far As far as running into our hunters but it adds it's more risky when it comes to running into ropes so you know um <laughs> 50 of one half dozen of the other i guess maybe <laughs> all right let's see if we can oh hey right there all right let's check our surroundings before we start doing just getting busy with wood collecting wood and stuff like that all right i think we're good um, okay, let's collect a bit of wood before we head back up just to feed the fire. I don't want to use all my fuel bricks if I don't have to. Or, you know, sometimes collecting wood's good anyways. I mean, it's always useful. I, I'm probably going to need a whole ton of it to fix my base because I was gone. 
<laughs> that's just yeah so oh man i'm really that that was from yeah that that attack that was from the uh the the fisherman that got spooked at, at the end of the last episode at night oh boy what are you gonna do you know that other cougar could spawn in any time and i would be in trouble i think hmm. hey blueberries all right Let's get back up to the base because it's going to get super cold super fast when the sun goes down. Uh, fortunately, it's not raining, otherwise, we'd be in even more trouble. Oh, yeah, there goes the light. Yeah. Is that a. Oh, it's a rabbit. <laughs> uh. Before I could see him, he, uh, w or identify what it was, he, uh, took off. <laughs> uh, I thought it was either a rabbit or a, um, uh, like a, a fiber. And I, w and I wasn't about to, you know, shoot, shoot a fiber. <laughs> that would, because that would have been sad. That would have been silly. Okay. All right. Now, any materials? Hey, we got uh, some scrap here. Get... You know, the nice thing about the snow is that all the, the crates and the loot, they sort of stand out, don't they? They're a little bit easy. Oh, look, like that right there. Yeah, and there it goes. There's my temperature dropping like a rock. Is that my base or is that Charlie? Oh, no, that's my, that's, that's, that. oh, that must be, is that, I guess that's Charlie's base and that's mine. Wow. All right, let's hang out in here. Now, we don't have a light, of course, because uh, uh, this, this building doesn't have a BCU. And the reason why we don't have a BCU is because if we did, uh, we would get a, a fourth hunter base. So, yeah, and we don't want that. Um, okay, let's uh, get a bit of... There we go. Let's get a bit of fire going. And uh, maybe... Hey, we should, we should do a little bit of cooking... Uh, we've got ourselves some chickens. We can put them on there, too. All right. And then uh, we have a bit of water. Nice, nice. Have some of our uh, stuff. I'll leave, the, I'll leave these tomatoes here just because. There we go. That's just about the right amount. And, uh, yeah. And we should be fine. All right. Um, now, let's see. We got you. Um, I'm. You know, I might actually... I'll have to decide what to do. I might leave the wood because I'm I'm probably going to have to do repairs on this base. But that's why all this is here. But uh, I am going to uh, take these nails back with me because nails are handy. But I'll leave these ones at the base just in case I want to do any building or... Oh, wait a minute. Okay. Actually, you know what we could do? Let's let's be productive. How about that? I, I like that idea. Uh, I think what we're going to do... Let's grab you and you. Let's um, make some boards. Uh... Like that. And, oh, yeah. I'm going to put you away. And, oh, actually, we could cook you into biofuel. Oh, I already did. Oh, nice. Now, we have to remember to take that back with us at some point. Okay. And then we got you and you. And then we can basically have that and one of those. Save the other for the morning. Okay. Drop that off. Carrots. Uh, seeds. And then we've got some fiber. Um, might as well put that there. I'm going to keep that on me. Keep that on me. Uh, keep that. And um, you could leave the apple here. I mean, an apple's nice to have for food, right? And then, oh yeah, I want to cook that chicken. It's going to go bad anyways if I don't, so. And we'll take this back with us and... There we go. All right. So there we that's that's pretty well what I was wondering or what I was thinking we should should have with us. Oh, actually, let's move you down, you down. There we go. All right. So, I've got some let's grab the nails in the cordage and I want to make um you're still cooking. What I want to do is uh we're going to I want to put a, a a thing here. Hang on. Let's put a wall. Keep feeling like I'm getting snuck up on. <laughs> Put a wall there. I could get away with a half wall here, but I think I'm going to have to use a full wall. Here, let's get warm. 
and uh, rescue our chicken that's probably already cooked. And uh, now, where's the meat? There it is, right there. Okay. Now, oh, of course, we could also eat this uh, grub if we got really hungry. Okay, there we go. Let's put that one down. So I'll, the first one I want to put is now. This is basically just to make it look. It both it's both functional and uh, to make to give it a better look. So essentially, what what this will do is sort of give it a, a bit of a body, and it prevents the uh, the cougar from running under underneath. Um, we could put in another one. Uh, full wall, and then eventually what we could do is upgrade these with um, iron, iron iron plating, and it'll make it a lot more resilient against the cougar. Probably this one. Ah, I should probably use full walls. Just be done with it. Yeah, I think I should. Okay, let's put you here. Uh, is that the right? Yeah, it's good. Like that. There we go. Oh yeah, it's looking looking sweet. Uh, okay, and we have now. How much is a wall? Uh, I need four. So let's make ourselves another board. And how are we doing? Oh yeah, the cordage is low too. Uh, we do have a bit of. How's this? Oh, it's good. Okay. Uh, we do have some fiber as well, so I could make some more cordage if I had to. All right, let's make a wall. Ah, yes, I'm gonna... Let's just make a couple more cordage just to have at the base. And then we'll just put this here. I mean, I could probably just leave the fiber here and be done with it, actually, now that I think about it. But that's fine. And we don't need you, and we don't need you, but we do need you. And, yeah, so we've depleted our build supplies, but that's all right. This is one of the things that I really wanted to do was to get this all sorted out. Okay. Okay. There we are. So there's our hunting cabin. And it's complete with uh, sub-basement. <laughs> All right. Um, this is a place to go. Uh, I think we're in the next day. So this is a good place to stop. So thank you very much for being here. It was, uh, you know, it was it was kind of exciting. Well, somewhat exciting. I mean, coo I always, we, we, we rode a cougar. I mean, come on. Cougar riding. I mean, how can you, how could you go wrong with that? All right. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time. You all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hang on. Let's take a look out here. There we go. What a view. All right. Bye-bye.